In this video, we provide the solution to question number 19 from the practice final exam for Math 1060. In which case, given this diagram, which I should mention, the circle in consideration is in fact a unit circle. Notice we have two examples of radii of this circle being length one. So this is in fact the unit circle. And so using this unit circle uh, diagram, we need to prove that tangent of theta, where theta is this angle in consideration here, is equal to the length AE. So we're trying to show that this distance right here is the same thing as tangent of theta. What are we allowed to use to prove that? Well, first of all, we know this is the unit circle. So this is a radius, this is a radius, those are length one. And since we have a point on the unit circle, we know that the x coordinate here is cosine of theta and the y coordinate is sine of theta as illustrated on these two sides of a right triangle. And so the basis of this argument is going to be around similar triangles. So consider the triangle uh, AOC right here. You're always going to use this triangle. And what are we going to compare it to? Well, we need to use a right triangle that has AE in it, where we have AE right here, in which case that seems to suggest that we should use this triangle right here. All right, that was kind of sloppy there. We're using this triangle right here. And so we then claim, and this is how the proof's going to start here. So note that the triangle AOC is similar to the triangle. Well, how does it compare, right? I and mean, we have to make sure the vertices connect with each other correctly, right? So notice the theta, the angle uh, coincides with both of these. And there's also a right angle of A right here, uh, the right angle is there and there as well. So when you do this correspondence, angle A in the original triangle right here, this is the complement of angle theta, for which that would have to be angle E right here. So we see that the vertex A coincides with E. What about O? O coincides with theta, which then would be O again, right? So you get O like so. And then the right angle, which for the original triangle is at C, coincided with A, like I said earlier, in which case we get the following. The triangle AOC is similar to the triangle EOA. I put those in order to make the following statements a lot easier. Thus, we get by proportions that AE over, right? So notice AE is the side we're trying to consider right here. What does AE coincide with? AE on this one, so with respect to, I'm actually gonna draw these triangles to the side for a moment. Here's angle theta, right? So this is OCA. With respect to angle theta, this is the opposite side, this is the adjacent side, and this is the hypotenuse, like so. And then if we do this triangle right here, again, I'm just gonna draw it the way it is on the screen. Theta like so, O, E, and A. So with respect to theta, this is the opposite side, this is the adjacent side, and this is the hypotenuse. That also can help you figure out which vertices coincide with each other. So AE with respect to theta is the opposite side. So that will coincide with AC, which is the opposite side with respect to the other theta triangle. All right, so we wanna compare AE with AC, but what else do we do? Well, what can go with AE? We have to pick another side of the triangle, which OE, we don't really know anything about. It's, it's longer than one, I guess, but OA right here, it's a radius of the unit circle. So that's the one I wanna know. So OA right there. Now OA, notice here is the adjacent side of the triangle. So we have to compare that to the adjacent side over here uh, for that triangle, which would be OC like so. So now using the diagram, what can we do here? AE, we don't know. OA is a radius of the unit circle, so that is one. What about AC? AC is equal to, here, sine of theta. And then OC is equal to cosine of theta, like, though, like so. And so simplifying that, we end up with AE is equal to sine theta over cosine theta, which is tangent theta. And so therefore, we've now proven the statement that AE is equal to tangent of theta.